What's up guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a huge end of summer haul for you guys. So I hope you guys are excited because I am. I got so much new clothes. I shopped at three different places and I'm very happy with my purchases. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. So let's start off with Gymshark first. Um, I wanted to get some biker shorts and like all the other places, well not all the other places, Lululemon were just completely out and that's just the place I usually shop at and I just really wanted to try Gymshark out. So I got two pairs of biker shorts. They are exactly the same. I got a black pair just like this with the Gymshark logo at the back and it has a little Gymshark logo right here. They seem very, very small, but they are actually very, very long. I wish they were a little bit shorter, but I still like them a lot. I don't feel that they're that flattering on me, but um, that's totally fine. It might just be in my head, but they are like really comfortable still. Um, they're just, they go very, very high up on your waist. So if you don't like when things go like past your belly button, almost under your boobs, then like definitely don't get these. But for me, it just doesn't bother me too, too much. It kind of does a bit, but not that much. I still really, really like these shorts and I will be wearing them. I've worn them to the gym a couple of times and it just feels so good to like have a part of my legs not be covered by leggings. So I do enjoy these, even though they're not exactly what I expected. The next pair of shorts that I got are exactly the same, but in a gray material have the little Gymshark logo at the front and they have the Gymshark logo at the back. They're exactly the same style, the same material, the same everything. They look really small, but they're still pretty long. And yeah, I like them a lot. I didn't think at first the gray ones, I liked them too much when I saw them out of the package, but I kind of do really like them. I feel like they're really nice, especially with the black sports bra that matches the black writing at the back. I think that looks really, really cute. So I will be wearing these to the gym which i already have i've worn these to the gym already and i kind of really enjoy them the only thing i have to say which i'm noticing right now but i had noticed when i wore them i just forgot they have like these little strings i don't know if you guys can see there's little strings on the stitching but um that's like not a big deal i feel like a lot of clothing comes like that so i'm not too too bothered by that the next place that I shopped at was Garage. You guys know that I always shop at Garage. Um, I have been shopping there a lot less these days just because I feel like their clothing just doesn't suit my style that much anymore, but they are coming out with their fall collection. So I'm hoping that I'm gonna be able to find more things that I'll enjoy. The first thing that I got are these white jeans. I just had to get a pair of white jeans. I've been wanting some for a long time and then I finally got these and the bottoms are so, so cute. I know you can't see the bottoms on the try on parts. I just wanna show you guys what they look like. They're like this. I actually have them folded over so like usually they'd be like this, which I find really, really cute. I have another pair of jeans that I got from Garage that are like that also. So I do love that a lot. The only thing I have to say about these jeans is that they're high-waisted but i wish they were just a bit more high-waisted like these ones are their high-waisted ones but then they have um they have like another high-waisted size and then they have another high-waisted size over that and i like the one in the middle um but it's totally fine i've worn these a couple of times and i think they look really really great especially with a tan the last thing that i got from garage is another pair of jeans these were 15 dollars, and i was like might as well but they looked a lot like a darker wash online if you see in the try on part they look really dark on me and that's what they look like online that's not what they look like in real person and they are very high waisted can you guys see they literally go up to like my waist like really really high over my belly button like a bit too high um but it doesn't really bother me just because they were only 15 dollars so even if i don't like wear them too too much i'm not too bothered by that and i I wasn't able to return them anyway, so it was really like a hit or miss situation and this was maybe more leaning towards the miss, but I, like hopefully I'll still be wearing them. It's just I feel like they're very uncomfortable because of high, how high waisted they are. So I'll let you guys know. I'll probably wear them during the fall and see how I feel about them. The next place that I shopped at is, well the last place that I shopped at is at Abercrombie & Fitch. This place has been my new obsession ever since quarantine started. They have been having sale after sale after sale and their clothes is so, so cute. Um, I was actually watching yesterday 
one of my New York vlogs and I was saying in that vlog how I just need to get out of this store because we were in the Abercrombie store and I'm like everything is so expensive I can't afford anything in here and like Abercrombie came through like everything was on sale everything has been on sale since quarantine I will say their sales are going a bit down right now just because like ev like regular life is kind of picking back up especially where I live so which is totally fine like I understand but um, I'm gonna miss all those sales because that was just amazing I got so so much clothes so let's get right into it Let's start with bathing suits. I got three new bathing suits from Abercrombie. They were so, so cheap. I literally got each one of these for about $25 each, which is crazy to me. $25 each at Abercrombie for bikinis, like the full bathing suit. Like, that's crazy. I got one bikini, two um, one-piece bathing suits. So let's get right into it. So this first bikini is a yellow one. Well, first bikini, it's the only bikini I got. It's a yellow one, it is very, very cheeky at the back. I love it a lot. I've worn this a couple of times already and I got this in a size medium. Oh, I forgot to mention, I got the Gymsharks in a size small, both of the shorts and then for the pants from Garage, I both got those in a size three and I'll try to have everything linked down below for you guys if you guys are interested in purchasing any of these. I do know that some of these might be out of stock or they might not be available anymore so I'm sorry if I can't find them. I'll try to find something very similar and if I can't then I'm very sorry. Um, especially like the jeans that were $15, they might not be available anymore so. Anyways, I got this bottom right here in a size small and I really really like it. It was kind of like tight at first on me but it kind of stretched out with the water and everything and now it fits perfectly and i love it and it goes with this top right here which is kind of similar to the other top i got from abercrombie um from their um well from their swimsuit collection that year well this year and is this style of top right here i'm having trouble holding it up because there is like wiring under it here and it's a ribbed material if you guys hadn't noticed and i really like this a lot i will say that like right here the stitching is like kind of off i don't know if you guys can tell can you guys see like the stitching at the top it looks like someone just like cut it off but i don't mind because i literally paid like i think this top was like 12 dollars, so i literally do not care it was so cheap and then it just clips out the back with these hooks that go into the like little tube like this and the straps are adjustable i also got the top in a size small and honestly like this color is so flattering on any any skin color so i would definitely recommend getting this if i can find it in link it down below because i'm not sure if it's still available their stuff has been going out of stock so fast this summer so you really have to like grab it when you see it so i'll try to find it for you guys but if i don't i know they just came out with another line of swimwear which is so so cute but i cannot justify buying any more bathing suits i literally do not have any more space in my drawer for bathing suit it is overflowing right now so i cannot by buying any more bathing suits from there or other than the fact that it doesn't fit in my drawer it is also the, almost the end of summer and it will be getting cold within the next month where i live so anyways the next one that i got is exactly the same color exactly the same material it is this ribbed material and it is a one piece and i think that it is so so cute i don't I didn't really notice if it was like super cheeky, but it's still like kind of cheeky, but it does cover up a bit more if you guys are more comfortable wearing that kind of bathing suit. This one was probably like $20. It was really, really cheap. And I think the top is just so cute. You can kind of see a bit of side boobs on the side. So just letting you guys know if you don't like it, but I personally really don't mind. And then the back is really cute. It just crosses over like that and you have like a fully open back, which I find very, very flattering. So yeah, it is this bikini right here. It does come with padding, um, but I took them out because I just don't like padding. And I had to tighten these up so much for, for it to be tight on me and not be loose and that the padding goes like right here on me instead of going on my boobs so i just took the padding out i got that in a size small i don't know if i mentioned i keep forgetting but when you guys check down below i'll put all the sizing beside every item that i purchased anyways the next piece that i got is literally exactly the same piece as the yellow uh, bathing suit it is a green bathing suit though and it is identical it has the same v cut right here you can kind of see side boob and then it crosses over at the back kind of cheeky and i really really like this one so much like i literally wore it the other the other day just walking around in the apartment like i just love this color so so much and i feel like it was like 
not that popular the last couple of years but like this is one of my favorite bikini colors or swimwear colors or like just clothing colors just because it goes so well like it complements my skin tone and my hair and my eyes really really well so i love wearing this kind of color i got this in a size small i'll have it linked down below if it's still available and i do recommend like if you guys can find this like definitely purchase it i love this bathing suit so much the next thing that i got are body suits I have a new obsession with bodysuits. At first, when the trend started, I was like, no, I do not like bodysuits. And now I'm all about the bodysuits. Like, that's all I'm purchasing. And when I'm looking for just a simple tank top to wear with, like, just a regular pair of shorts or something like that, I can't find any because all I have are bodysuits. So let's get right into it. The first one I got, I am obsessed with you guys. It is so cute and I feel like this is something you would find like on Princess Polly which I've never shopped on there before but I just feel like this is something you would find there it is this bodysuit right here with the little bow ties at the top like how cute is that guys um it has like a little lining right over here if you guys can see I do 100% recommend wearing um nipple stickers with this just because they will poke through like you guys will see on the try on part i was too lazy to put the nipple stickers on you'll probably see my nipples are kind of see through so don't mind that whatever i don't really care but i do like if i go out and wear this i will put nipple stickers on because you do see through so definitely put those on but yeah it's super super cute i got in a size small i love the little bow ties i'm debating on whether or not i want the black one also because i feel the black one would be so cute during fall but i think it's out of stock right now so we'll have to wait until it comes back in stock and it goes on sale the only downside to this and i'm like abercrombie why would you do this why would you not help the girls out why would you do this this is just a pain in the ass it does not have a clip on the bottom so if you're wearing this and you have to go to the bathroom, then you have to get butt naked to go to the bathroom, which sucks because like that's why they put clips on these. So that's the only thing. But honestly, guys, it is so worth it. I like don't care that much that it doesn't have the clips on it. And it's so, so soft. I love it so, so much. And like, honestly, I will be purchasing the black one if it comes back in stock. Hopefully it will come back in stock soon and it'll be on sale because as I have mentioned before, I cannot afford Abercrombie if it is not on sale because it is way too expensive. <laughs> so the next bodysuits, the, the next two bodysuits that I got are exactly the same and one of them I got only just because I was ordering and I didn't want to pay shipping fees and I was like, oh, it's on sale. I'm just going to add this into it. And at first I was like not sure about these bodysuits and I'll show you guys why. So the first one that I purchased, I purchased because I love this color. It is this one right here with the little details on it right here. You guys will be able to see on the try on part because I know I showed it I and mean, you can't really pick up on this camera right now. But yeah, it has those little details right here that's kind of like the like kid tank tops. Like I feel like I had a tank top with this on it when I was like six years old, but it is so cute. At first I was really not sure, but I definitely love this so much and it is so, so cute. I love this color. It looks really good right now with the tan that I have, my skin tone, color, my eyes and my hair and it will look really great during the fall which is awesome we love pieces that can transition into other seasons and this one does have the little clip on the bottom that you can clip on and off which is great thank you abercrombie we love this and the straps are kind of like elastic straps they're kind of stretchy so this is the one that i purchased on purpose because i thought it was so cute i love the love the color and then i got this exact same one in black so is literally the same thing but in black and at first i was like why did i order this in black like i don't even like the little ruffles at the top right here that much but i really really like them and i'm sorry if you guys can see like all the cat hairs that are on here we have two cats and they shed a lot so all of our clothes is covered in cat hair we have to roll ourselves every single time we want to leave the house so yeah that's about having two cats <laughs> um but anyways, yeah, this one, like I mentioned, it has the clips and I got them in a size small. I will usually go for a size small unless I'm really, really not sure, then I'll go for a size medium, but I'm typically a size small. The next purchase that I got, I got um, two long sleeve shirts. The first one is this one right here. This white long sleeve shirt with the little Abercrombie logo here. And then it has a big Abercrombie writing in the back, which I did not know because you could not tell on the website that there was writing on the back. But I don't care. I got these to wear with the um, biker shorts. 
I got them in a size large, especially to wear with the biker shorts, but I don't think I'm gonna be doing that because I honestly love these with like a tight knot at the front and just with a pair of jeans. I love, love that, or with a pair of leggings. So I'll probably just be wearing these like all the time. I have a picture on Instagram wearing this one. Like I really love these shirts. I really thought these were gonna be like lounge around while you do homeschooling next session wearing kind of shirts. No, like I'm gonna be wearing these all the time. I love it. It's so, so soft. Um, I got this one in large and then then I got another one. I got it in X large because it was just not coming back in stock in large. It would do like small, medium, X large, X small, and it would never come back in large. So I just, when it came back in an X large, I decided to get the X large. It's kind of big, but like honestly, I don't care. I do prefer the large with the white, but I'll show you guys what the other one looks like. It's this blue color right here. With the little Abercrombie logo at the front and then it says Abercrombie on the sleeve. This one I got in X large. It is huge on me. And the only thing I will say is Abercrombie. When you put pictures of your clothing online, it has to be the same color as what I'm going to receive. Or very, very similar because this was a pastel blue. Like pastel, like almost white when I was ordering it. And I got it and it's a lot darker, but I don't care because I really like this color. I feel like this color goes really well, again, with my skin tone, my eyes, it makes my eyes pop. So I really don't mind that much, but I was expecting a lighter blue color. But yeah, I really love this one a lot. Also, it is a bit bigger than I would have liked it to be, but I really, really love it. And I'm gonna be wearing it all the time, like so, so much. Can you just imagine this in the fall with a pair of jeans and like an oversized, like not sweater but like jacket over it like, i don't know like this is just such a casual outfit and i love this shirt so so much i do not regret this purchase i love 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 it so 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 much now let's talk about this purchase okay abercrombie let's talk about this purchase i got this dress right here this beautiful red dress that kind of goes you can wear it off the shoulders you can wear it on your shoulders it has a little bow tie at the front has a little like lining right here right under your boobs it's really tight it has pockets it has like a little stretch at the back to make sure that you can fit into it it is so cute it is so pretty but abercrombie it was burgundy on your website why did it come in red Again, my fault, I should have checked. It was written red on it, but it was burgundy on your website. Like my memory card was full. Sorry about that. What was I saying? Oh yeah, Abercrombie. Your pictures was so inaccurate that I thought, although I should have checked the color that was written on the, on the bottom, right under it, it said red, which is on me, but it was burgundy. This was burgundy. Like I showed everyone and it was burgundy. Am I upset that it came in red? No, would I would have would I have liked it in burgundy? Absolutely, but am I upset? No, because this is such a cute summer dress. Like this looks like Princess Polly, and like it is adorable. It is so so cute. I got it in a size small, and it has pockets, guys. It has pockets. Like what's better than that? A dress that has pockets. Like every girl understands me right now. If a dress has pockets, it is the best best dress ever. I don't care if it's not the color that I want. I don't care if it's not the length that I want. I don't care if it's not the style that I want. It is the best dress ever. Anyways, let's move on from this. The next thing that I got is a white dress. I can realize that on a hanger, you cannot even see what it looks like. But I wore this during my um, during my vlog where we went to, um, for on a road trip for Alex's birthday. I wore this for his birthday dinner. Is this white dress? It kind of comes up like this in a V on your chest. And there's a zipper on the side right here and it goes all the way down and it has a little slit at the front and then the straps, I was gonna say sleeves. <laughs> There's definitely no sleeves on this dress. The straps on this dress kind of tie up like this at the top you can do a little bow on the top which is really, really cute. It's kind of a linen material. It's very, very nice. Like the quality is amazing. I do think there's like a default in mine cause like right here it's kind of like folded weird. I don't know if you guys can tell. Um, but like that's fine. I think I'm sure I can like iron it, iron it out if I can even use an iron on this material. Maybe I can't. So we'll we'll see. Um, I got this in a size small. It is on the tighter side. So if you're hesitating, I would not size up personally for me in a medium. But if you prefer it looser or you just don't want to be too snug then I would definitely size up in this dress I don't even know if it's still available like I'm giving you guys all these tips 
on how to order this dress and I don't even know if it's still available I'll try to find one for you guys I'll try to find it for you guys but anyways it is so so cute I really like it a lot and I'm sad that there aren't too many occasions coming up this summer that well by the end of the summer that I'm gonna be able to wear this for so I'll have it for next year for sure because like this is a timeless dress it's a little white dress like it's timeless I really like it a lot the last thing that I got is very fall at first I was like maybe I'll be able to wear this during the summer but no it is so so warm when you put it on like I get so hot wearing it but this is gonna look so cute during the fall during the winter even during the spring maybe not as much during spring I feel like it's not really a spring piece but let me show you guys I am obsessed okay little backstory on this piece I saw this piece in Abercrombie like on their website in like December and I was like that's so cute but it was like almost a hundred dollars I don't remember how much it was maybe it wasn't even a hundred dollars but it was like really really expensive for a skirt and I was like I'm not paying that price for a skirt and then the price dropped it dropped at like $34 and I was like $34 for the skirt I am getting it I am jumping on that and I am getting this damn skirt here it is it is guys it's so cute you guys aren't even ready is this kind of like faux leather skirt with the little buttons at the front there's a zipper at the back right here i got it in a size small before i forget and then it has this like belt around that goes all the way around and kind of cinches your waist in you can tie it you guys will be able to see on the trial it is so so cute but like this material i just can't wear this material during the summer so i'm gonna be wearing during the fall i was actually like like, let me know if you guys do this also. Yesterday, I was just trying on my clothes, and I was like, I cannot wait for fall. I was, like, doing a little show for Alex. I was like, look at this. This is going to be my outfits during fall. But the thing is, I'm not going anywhere during fall because school is all homeschool. So I'll probably just be wearing my pajamas during fall. But anyways, to go take pictures, those are going to be my outfits for fall. So I don't know if you guys do the same thing, but I just love going through my closet and, like, trying on different things and creating outfits. And I was putting this on yesterday with, like, different things and anyways i just i love this so much it's so so cute and i can't wait to wear it all right the video is done i have filmed all the clothing for you guys i really hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure to give this video a thumbs up subscribe down below for more i have so many video ideas like that i'm planning for the fall that's coming for the back to school maybe not as much back to school because like literally there's nothing to do for back to school like I'm homeschooled, well homeschooled. I'm gonna be doing school from home, so there's like not much to do. I have a couple of ideas. Um, my Instagram will be down below if you guys wanna follow me and I'll have everything that I can find linked down below. I cannot guarantee everything because honestly, you guys, I got this. All of this stuff was in my wish list. Sometimes they would disappear, sometimes they would reappear, and I would purchase them when they would reappear. So I might not be able to find everything. I hope I will, or I will find like a lot for you guys. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.